All right, hi friends, it's Miss Shay back for our third music lesson together on YouTube, which is weird, but kind of fun. And the first thing we're gonna do is movement to some music. We're gonna start with tippy toes, but these aren't just gonna be regular tippy toes, they're gonna be fast tippy toes. So can you get up on your tippy toes? I had to kick my shoes off for this one. It's totally okay if you do too. Tippy toes. any way you want, but be on your tippy toes and be safe. Gala! Tippy toes! Excellent. This is Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. The words are a little different than what you probably learned. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, what a wonderful child you are. With big bright eyes and nice round cheeks, a wonderful child from head to feet. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, what a wonderful child you are. <laughs> All right, preschoolers, this is a movement one we did last week. It's called One Finger, One Thumb. If you can't sing right now, that's okay. At least do the movements with me. One finger, one thumb, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. One finger, one thumb, keep moving to chase the flies away. Two fingers, two thumbs, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Two fingers, two thumbs, keep moving to chase the flies away. Two fingers, two thumbs, two arms, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Two fingers, two thumbs, two arms, keep moving to chase the flies away. Two fingers, two thumbs, two arms, two feet, keep moving, keep moving. Two fingers, two thumbs, two arms, two feet, keep moving to chase the flies away. Away. Two fingers, two thumbs, two arms, two feet, sit up, sit down, keep moving, keep moving. Two fingers, two thumbs, two arms, two feet, stand up, sit down, keep moving to chase the flies away. Phew! Okay, we got a new finger play this week, and I'm going to have to take off my glasses to do it because this one is called Grandma's Glasses. So let me do the whole thing for you once, okay, and you watch. You're gonna take your fingers and you're gonna put them on like glasses. And then you're gonna get out your little bitty grandma voice and you say it like this. These are grandma's glasses and this is grandma's hat. And this is the way she folds her hands and lays them in her lap. Now the second part, you have to have great big glasses and a great big voice because now you're grandpa. And you say, these are grandpa's glasses. And this is grandpa's hat. And this is the way he folds his arms just like that. Now let's do it one more time, but I'm gonna get my little big grandma glass and my little grandma voice. Will you repeat after me? So I go first and then you be my echo. These are grandma's glasses. Good. 
And this is Grandma's hat. Good. And this is the way she folds her hands. And lays them in her lap. Now, Grandpa Glass's big voice, I go first. These are Grandpa's glasses. Good job. And this is Grandpa's hat. Good. And this is the way he folds his arms. Just like that. Good job. You did great. I wonder if you remember last time we did uh, one that was called Ice Cream Sunday. And every time I said ice cream, you helped me out by going, mm, mm. Can you do that again today? We'll practice it. We really want to make our mmm go really up high like this. Mmm. So the first time it's going to go up high and the second time it's going to come back down low, okay? Today was a day I did everything right. Though my brother annoyed me, I still didn't fight. I played nicely all day. I didn't argue or scream. Now mom says I get to go for a dish of ice cream. Mm -hmm. I ate all of my breakfast and all of my lunch. I picked up my toys and I have a bunch. And since I've been helpful like part of a team, maybe I'll ask mom for two scoops of ice cream. Mm -hmm. Two scoops, what a treat. But I think you'll agree, it'd be hard to imagine someone better than me. I've done everything right or so it would seem. Maybe I'll ask mom for Four scoops of ice cream. Mm -mm. Yes, today has been special. It's not every day I do everything right in such a nice way. So why not, of course, since I'm building up stream, add chocolate syrup on top of four scoops of ice cream. Mm -mm. You've been perfect, young lady. That's what mom said today. So I know she won't mind if I have it my way. To the syrup add sprinkles and also whipped cream and a cherry on top of four scoops of ice cream. Mm -mm. And yet, when I think about wanting more, though it sounds oh so good, I know what's in store. I'll eat and I'll eat. Mm -hmm. Run out of steam and my tummy won't feel so good after all that ice cream. Since today was a day I did everything right, I won't spoil my record by making a sight. I'll ask most politely, though it was fun to dream, may I please have one scoop of vanilla ice cream? Oh, no, no, wait, 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 wait. How about chocolate ice cream? Mm -mm. Oh, no, no, wait, wait. Huckleberry ice cream. Mm -mm. Okay, I've got a new movement one that if we were together in the classroom and able to hold hands, we would do on a circle holding hands. But since we're by ourselves, if you can convince one of your family members to do this with you, you guys can make a little circle. I couldn't convince my kids to do it with me. They're both working in their class. So I'm gonna have to do it by myself. So I'm just gonna kind of walk around and maybe the second time I'll march around and then maybe the third time I'll gallop around and then maybe the last time when it's that time, I'll turn around like in my own little circle, okay? So I'll let you know what we're gonna do right before we get there. So the first time, let's just walk around and I'll sing the song for you. It goes like this. Here we go, Santa Maloney. Here we go, Santa Maloney. 
Here we go, Santa Maloney, as we go round about. Put your two hands on your shoulders. Put your two hands on your shoulders. Put your two hands on your shoulders as we go round about. I'm going to march this time. Here we go, Santa Maloney. Here we go, Santa Maloney. Here we go, Santa Maloney, as we go round about. Put your two hands up before you. Put your two hands up before you. Put your two hands up before you as we go round about. I think I'll gallop this time when I go around. Here we go, Santa Maloney. Here we go, Santa Maloney. Here we go, Santa Maloney, as we go round about. Put your two hands on your pockets. Put your two hands on your pockets. Put your two hands on your pockets as we go round about. I think I'm gonna tippy toe this time. Here we go, Santa Maloney. Here we go, Santa Maloney. Here we go, Santa Maloney, as we go round about. Put your two hands behind you. Put your two hands behind you. Put your two hands behind you as we go round about. I'm gonna spin this time, I hope I don't get too dizzy. Here we go, Santa Maloney. Here we go, Santa Maloney. Here we go, Santa Maloney, as we go round about. Getcha! So the next one is our echo song. Now, if you remember when we do an echo song, I sing first and then I point to you and you sing the same thing back to me, okay? So if I say, hello, you sing, hello. Okay, if I say hello, you sing hello. Pretty good, good job. <coughs> so I go first and you go second. Goes like this. Johnny on the wood pile. Johnny on the wood pile. Johnny on the fence. Johnny on the fence. Johnny got a haircut. Johnny got a haircut for 15 cents. For 15 cents. Wait, does it sound like it would be a good haircut if it only cost 15 cents? Maybe if you have a really nice barber? Maybe if you have an auntie who will do your hair for you? I don't know. This time you tell me how much, okay? I'll say 15 cents, but you tell me how much you should pay for a haircut, okay? Johnny on the wood pile. Johnny on the wood pile. Johnny on the fence. Johnny on the fence. Johnny got a haircut. Johnny got a haircut for 15. Since what do you think? Oh, that's probably more realistic. Good job. Our special activity for today is another movement, but we love movement. This one, I'm gonna play the music, and all you have to do is copy what they tell us to do. All right. Just a hint, it starts with walk. Walk. <laughs> Skate. Ooh, so we're gonna move 
smooth. Pretend like your feet are skating on ice, like it's really slippery. Make it smooth. Smooth skates right on the floor. Ha! Now, let's see if you can remember what the sounds tell you to do. From the music. Walk was first, right? Okay. Now we start with the easy one. That's good. You're doing great. For the ending of our music class today, all you have to do is sit and relax. If you have a family member there, you can cuddle up with them while you listen. And I'm going to use Snow White, my ukulele. Do you remember how many strings? Let's count. One, two, three, four. That's right. Since the ukulele is small, it only has four strings. Okay? So this song is called All the Pretty Little Horses. Hush, oh. 